everyone. This is me making bath bomb donuts. This is a grand total of the fourth time I've ever made bath bombs. The first time being yesterday. I've made four different batches to basically teach myself how to make bath bombs. I started with a very, very basic recipe and then worked my way through the three recipes that the soap chef has on her YouTube channel. And let me just tell you, she is a freaking genius. She is the guru of bath bombs and if you have questions, you should go watch her because she is amazing. So yeah, so I... I am very pleased with myself that I was able to successfully mold these uh, donut bath bombs. I have found the donut mold to be more challenging than the, than the regular round mold, which I guess is pretty normal. And apparently the donut mold is the next easiest mold, so yay me. <laughs> I've, ac I've accomplished phase two. Um, you might have seen in a previous video that I also did a little bit of airbrushing so that's very exciting. I think what I'll do tomorrow is I will airbrush these with a little bit of purple and maybe some black lustrum mica, mica just to, uh, I don't know, play around. I would also like to um, conquer the whole cocoa butter drizzle so I'll probably do that too and add a few little sprinkles of something just to make them pretty. And then I'm going to have like, I don't know, I've been making anywhere from 3 to 5 bath bombs at a time times 4. So I'm going to have like 15 or 20 bath bombs that I'm going to be giving to my daughter, my friend's son. And I don't even take very many baths, but I'm going to have to start, I guess. But yeah, it's been uh, quite the learning curve. It's definitely different than anything else that I do. And I don't hate it. I won't say that I love it, and I could not imagine ever... Um, making bath bombs full time or making large batches, I, I don't think that I would enjoy it because it is very messy and tedious. But this was fun and I think I will be making a few bath bombs here and there for my markets just for funsies. So yeah, if you uh, have any questions, um, this is not a tutorial by any stretch of the imagination. This is just me showing you that yes, I can actually make a bath bomb. <laughs> which is quite impressive if you know me at all. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one. Maybe I will record um, doing the airbrushing and drizzle tomorrow. Talk to you later. Bye bye.